Welcome back to a new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to make fully procedural subsurface gathering cheese in Blender. I already made a basic scene with a background and a cheese model I've made. I added a principal BSDF shader, set the roughness to 0.35 and set the IRR to 1.42. Increase the subsurface scattering to about 0.25. Then I played around with the colors until I got something I like. Choose a soft yellow orange color for the base color and a stronger yellow color for the subsurface scattering color. The subsurface scattering color is gonna be the color which is inside of the cheese and the base color is the surface of the cheese. Play around with the subsurface radius until you get something you like. We want some bump and some streaks where the cheese was cut. Because cheese never looks this perfect. Start by adding a bump node and add a noise texture. Add a color ramp in between. Play around with the noise texture. Change the contrast with the color ramp so you get some nice streaks. You can add a mapping node and scale the y-axis to something small like 0.1 or 0.2. This will make sure that the noise texture will get stretched out and you get long streaks where the knife has cut the cheese. It doesn't really make sense that these holes in the cheese also get the streaks too. For that, add an ambient occlusion node and a color ramp, increase the distance to 1.2 and also increase the contrast until you get as much black in the hold as possible. We can now add a mix RGB node and use the ambient occlusion as the factor. Make sure that the noise texture is plugged into the lower slot and lighten up the color one. Now add another color ramp And also make sure that you lower the bump strength so that it doesn't look that weird. Now you should have some streaks on your cheese. For even more detail you can add another noise texture and also a new color ramp. Add a new mix RGB node and mix both noise textures together. Increase the scale of the noise texture, roughen it up to about 0.6 and also lower the contrast a bit of the noise texture. Now we have got some nice streaks on the cheese. Now just render it out with nice quality and there you have it. Really nice beautiful subsurface scattering fully procedural cheese texture. I hope you enjoyed the video and have a nice day.